Good afternoon, everybody. Hello, happy Sunday. Happy Sunday. Here we are at the original LA Farmers Market. Mm -hmm. And we're gonna try out some pizza. Yes, we're gonna do a pizza shootout here. Now, yeah. there's a couple pizza places here that's been mm -hmm. here like forever. For years. For years. years, yeah. So, we're gonna put them to the test and see how they compare. Yeah, let's ready? Go. All right. Okay, our first place is called Dino's Gourmet Pizza. And we're gonna get like a, uh, a pepperoni, so that'll be constant at both places. There it is, Dino's Gourmet Pizza. Kids here, but Nico is going to be our special guest for the pizza. You never hear from our past vlogs. Yay! So, we're ready to dig into this thing. Look at this cheese. It's like perfectly placed. This is like super hot. Yeah, you want this? Yeah. Let's use it a little knife. That's a slice and a half right there. The cheese pool. Everybody knows about the cheese pool. That's the way to do it. Cool. <laughs> Let's see how this is. Is it hot? It's not that hot, but the cheese is really good and it's very melty. Mm. Wow. Two grooves. Two grooves from him. <laughs> That's pretty cool. So it's good? Yeah, it's good. All right. It's very good. You can see all that cheese on there. Perfect piece of pepperoni. There's little pools of that pepperoni juice on that. This crust, you can see it's folded over, and the pizza sauce goes all the way to the end of the crust. So, or to the end of the yeah of the folded over crust. Here we go. Mm. And cheese, not too salty at all. It's a good piece. All right, my turn for this pizza. Now this literally came just out of the pizza oven, so it definitely is tasty looking. Great cheese. That's the first thing that hits you, is the right tastiness, the right amount of salt in that cheese, and the pepperonis you can see. Nicely done. Of course, we really like those small little roni cups, this is still really good. You taste this uh, crust out. Um, it's a great crust. I like how they put a little, like a design on it. You can check it out over here on the regular side. So, uh, not only does it have a cool design, it tastes good too. Wow, I'm gonna see how, uh, how the other pizza place compares, but so far, the next pizza spot is called Pasia de Amores Pizzeria. It's been here for over 75 years. It's Whoa. right behind me. It's Pasia de Amores cheese pizza. Uh, pepperoni then. Oh, pepperoni. Oh, pepperoni. Pepperoni and cheese. Pepperoni. Uh, uh, oh, this one looks pretty good too. Yeah. Look at all those the pepperoni juices in there. Oh yeah. That looks good. This is also a medium, right? Yeah, medium 12 inch. inch. Yep. So what part to try? Let's try this crust right here. Oh, this is super hot. Here we go. This is gonna need a little bit of help. It's really oh, thin, huh? Yeah. Real thin. Uh, Pepperoni is falling off. But the cheese is right there. There we go. Okay, this is Patsy's. Let's try it out. Made his eyes roll. Yeah, made his eyes roll. That's pretty good. Um, 
Don't say your don't say your review yet. Decision. But don't say can, your decision. Yeah, don't know the decision, but you can explain the pizza. Okay. Well, it's a flatbread style pizza. Um, I'd say it's pretty good for a flat style for a flat style pizza. I'm not sure what else to say, but yeah, it's pretty good. I like it. It's a greasier pizza than the last pizza. There's no shortage of cheese or pepperoni on it though. Mm. 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 This is a good pizza. Not as the cheese is not as salty as the other pizza. Um, matches well with this crust. You can tell the crust is very well cooked. The sauce is very light on this pizza as well. What hits me on this pizza is the pepperoni oil on it. As the other one hits first the cheese, this one is the pepperoni oil that matches perfectly with that sauce and that really good pizza crust. Look at pizza. Patsy's pizza. Yeah. Look at that little pools of pepperoni oil. It's just dripping off the cheese. Also thin crust. This one doesn't seem to have as much cheese as the first one. But yet it, it tastes really well balanced. Yeah, the pizza sauce is not too tangy. Good taste on the crust. Not as crispy. The end is good. You can see the bottom is well is well cooked in the bottom. Yeah. Very foldable. Very likable. It's another good one too. It's gonna be a hard choice. Okay, that's gonna wrap up our pizza shootout here at the original LA Farmers Market. That was good. Yeah, it was very good. So you see, we have plenty to go. And yeah, let's get right down to it. Uh, it's a regular countdown? Uh-huh, regular countdown. Okay, so it's going to be either Dino's or uh, Patsy's. Patsy's. You ready? Mm -hmm. Three, two, one. Dino's. Dino's. <laughs> yep. We all said the same thing. Wow, Dino's was a clear um, runaway. Why was it? Uh, because um, what really stood out for me was the cheese. Yeah, it was, good it was cheese. the cheese. Mm -hmm. I agree. The cheese was the perfect saltiness, and it matched really well with the sauce. So yeah. that was good. And I have to third that that motion. The cheese was it had a more cheese than Patsy's. The crust on Dino's was a little more crispy, which I enjoyed. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And that cool design, how can you not like that? Yeah, it's pretty. It was pretty, yeah. right? Yep, that's it, babe. All right, well that's gonna wrap up our pizza shootout. Thank you to Nico, our special guest. Yay! Woo! <laughs> well, thanks everybody for watching, and we'll catch you guys in the next one.